Good day guys, for today's video I want to show you the methodology on how to lift the roof panel in 20th story building using manual method. In this animation it will show the safety procedures, methods, and materials needed. Before we start, can you give me some support by hitting like and subscribe button. Hit the notification bell if you want this kind of videos and don't forget to share also. To start, we won't do the job if it can't be accomplished safely, because safety is our top priority, so these are the safety reminders. Install signages, barricades around the area that you are going to do the lifting. Wear proper PPEs such as helmet, reflective vest, gloves, safety shoes, etc. Ensure the safety above the building by installing some platforms or roofing panels that can be stepped on during the lifting process. Manpower above the building must properly wear safety harness anchored properly on the lifelines. Manual lifting method of roofing materials on a 20-story building. Choose an area that can accommodate or have enough space considering the quantity and length of roofing materials to be lifted. Set up guide wires, at least number 10 or 4 mm diameter, that will be securely tied and fastened on top of the building where the materials will be lifted. The other end of these wires will be inserted to a PVC pipe at least 1 1 half diameter at 1 meter length before tied and fastened by metal studs or other materials that can hold the wires on the ground. Quantity or number of setup and spacing of guide wires will depend on the length of the roof panels to be lifted. Recommended spacing is at least 2.5 meters. Connect pulleys on top of the building or in the roof frames spaced in between the installed guide wires by welding or clamp. Lifting ropes, can be nylon ropes 20 mm diameter will be inserted to the pulleys and the other end is inserted also in the PVC pipes with the ends exposed enough to tie on the whole width of the roof panels to be lifted. At least two pulleys can be motorized depending on the number of pulleys and ropes to be used. The motors can help the manpower ease the lifting works and make it faster. To start the lifting process, tie the exposed rope on the ground around the roof panels. Make sure that it will not be tied rope will not come loose. After ensuring that the tie of rope will not break or loose, manpower on top of the building will pull the rope at once. They can count to make sure that they are pulling at the same time. When the materials reach the top, 
tie the ropes on a sturdy structure to make sure that it will not fall. Others will handle the materials immediately, then if they are sure that they can lift and move the materials to the desired position, move it carefully. To continue the lifting process, just do again the steps 5 to 7 until all the materials needed were lifted. Make sure that the lifted materials were properly secured and windproof by tying them in the roof purlins or structure with rope. After the lifting process is done, Clean the area and fix all use things, such as safety signages, barricades, guide wire, ropes, etc. Watch the full video on how I made. See the link in the description below. Thank you for watching Drafts and Count. Thank you for supporting my videos hope you like, and gain some knowledge it.